So, last week, we, um, we've we managed to do the direction, yeah? We kick it quick and dirty wrote it uh, that allows us to just basically spin on the axis, yeah? So what we need to what we need to do today is see if we can actually uh, perform the forward and backwards. Uh, so not the just the forward because we've done we've done left and right, and I have to remind myself what the characters were, uh, what the keyboard commands were. I think it was greater than less than, wasn't it? Yeah. Um. So we can spin on the spot. Uh, in fact, we'll fire it up. So, let's see. Are we in hard mode? Apparently not. Yeah, we are. I keep forgetting we've put a pause in, haven't we? Da, 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 da. Right, so that's in medium mode. Okay. Which I fixed. So, let's go in hard. Da, 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 da. Right, so we should be able to. There we go. So this is. So we are at the. T we've we've relocated to the top. Yeah. So we're looking in that direction. We may need to put what direction you are looking at, which is governed by this fella up here because that's the direction we're going. Um, maybe we need to put on there where we're going. We'll need to move this as well. Uh, da, 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 da. So, left. Go left. Should be a wall. It is. Looking behind us. That's strange. Oh, hang on. No. Looking east. Go that way. We are looking... We're looking up. <laughs> That's it. I'm getting a bit. I'm, I'm, I'm just. I've forgotten. Where's my bits of paper? I've forgotten. Where is it? Aha! Here we go. Right, yeah, so we're looking up. <laughs> I've forgotten. Right, looking up. Then we should be looking. Right, that's east. Now the C is looking, no, that C is looking up, that's looking up, then that's looking down, left, that's right, so we're, lo we're looking that way, left, 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 no, that's not right, or at, at, that's it, at, we're looking left. Is that right? That's looking east. B, two is looking east. Right. Then, one is looking down. So that's looking down. All oh, right. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I don't think we're. I don't think we're in. We're in the start place. I think. Yeah. Right, so we need to figure out how to move it anyway. So we can rotate round. And I've got the map working as well. I've got that map working. Hi, John here. Another subscriber. Stay a while. Stay forever. Hey. On orange, hello. Thank you for subscribing. And why has my bot not worked? Oh, I've broken it again. Let me have a quick look. Let's have a look. Oh! Da, 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 da. <laughs> yeah. Oh, latest subscribers blowing a fuse. I didn't... Oh, I didn't realise... 
Okay. Well, thank you very much for popping in. It's, I've got to, I think it's that. There we go. Does that change? There we go. Look, that's why it failed, because it's got no months on it. N-A-N. <laughs> -N. I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to look at me bot again. Good job it's a beat. It's in beta. <laughs> Oh, cheers, Doxter. <laughs> Thanks for the bits, mate. Right. So, we are going to try... We are going to try and implement the forward motion. So, we've got the left, look left, look right, turn... Or, I should turn, say, turn left, turn right. We've got it rendering the, um, the 3D quick and dirty by the way it's not written perfectly but we're going to get into we'll get into that into in later videos where we're going to take up this repetition code and we're going to try and make it a global routine that does the does the 3d layering instead of slicing it and um so but i wanted to get i wanted to get things working so now we do have a control, I think it's in player, player control. So we do have a system where we can move about, yeah? And, you know, and what we do is we, we look for the key. We look for the key. Who oh, my merch store? I'm going to have to buy, I'm going to have to buy myself a bottle. I want a bottle out my merch store. Um, we look where we get where it is. We find out if we can go in that direction, and if we can, then we move. Yeah. So this is what we need to do for um, the 3D version. But the 3D version is slightly different because the if you remember the 2D version. So the 2D version. So if we do that, we'll do it in easy mode so I can see where I'm going. So the 2D version, right? So we know where we are, we're up there. So we've got AZ left, uh, greater than, less than. So we move according to the keys that we provide it, yeah? So if I wanna go right, I press right. If I wanna go up, I press up. If I wanna go right, I press right, up, and like that, yeah? So I'm actually telling it which direction to go. The difference with the 3D, the 3D version is you are pointing in that direction. You are looking in that direction. So if you want to go forward, you forward it in the direction that you're looking in. So we need to change the way the player controls work. Right? And what I was thinking was instead of we 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 look at the, the keys, we look at the keys, and then Instead of saying um, left goes left, right goes right, and stuff like that, we have a key press routine that looks at the keys and then sets a flag. Yeah? Yeah, the, 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 the code for the... Right, this is how it works, Origin. The code for... Um, the streams and stuff like that. All my patrons have access to the code straight away if you're on the $5 tier mark. I don't go patron hunting. If you want to become a patron, that is most generous of you. And if you're on the $5 tier, then you will get access to all the code that we see in the streams, except for Hunchback, because that is a community thing, and if you want to help play with that, you have to ask for access. But you get access straight away. But if, you, if you're... If you don't want to become a patron, which is fine, uh, when assistant producer, yes, it is assistant producer. And so if you don't become a patron, then when the videos come out in four, I think it's four months, uh, patrons get to see the videos four months before anybody else. Yeah. Um, then the code will then become available when the videos become available on YouTube. Yeah. 
so they will be available but the patrons get to see the code straight away when i finish the stream tonight they will get it will get uploaded to the patron repo and then they can mess around with it and play with it and stuff like that so you can actually see it so that's how it works yeah but i don't pa i don't patron hunt um if you want to become a patron thank you very much it's much appreciated if not that's fine you will get to see the code eventually but the patrons get early access to the code like they do with the videos right that's enough self-promotion there <laughs> shameless you're joking no way have you oh my god mate that is so generous mate right um you'll get um you'll get a, a mess a message from patreon i think um with all the things and then um you'll be able to link it to my discord so there's the discord link up there if you, when you when you go into discord and you link discord to patreon you'll become golden welcome to the golden family by the way um and then i'll i will <laughs> I don't go I don't, I don't go patron hunting <laughs> Oh Stuart Who's a patron himself? Uh good one mate, good one. Um but if you DM me with your GitHub username, I'll get that sorted, yeah? At um tomorrow or sometime. <laughs> yes you are mate you are a you are a patron and a, and a, subs a twitch subscriber how do you oh you're golden aren't you twitch is blue you're golden patrons ah yes Stuart. yes you are you did last month uh, last week yeah ah oh, you guys so generous so generous right so Back to, back to the matter in hand. Is that okay for you? Yeah. On origin. Is that all? Is that uh, okay for you? I'll sort it out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Only because you're getting pretty good, mate. I I saw your stream. I watched the vod this afternoon. I saw your stream. Oh, oh, dude. Not yet, not yet. What game are you reverse engineering? A view to a kit. Ooh. So I... Have you have you watched my videos on how to reverse engineer? Yeah, Dig Dug. Dig Dug was a recent recent one. Um but in my in my um in my re um, repo I've got Python scripts that allow you to convert um, the disassembly from infiltrator into either kick format or uh, CPS format now CPS is CBM prog studio format Doxter Dox the the, the dig dug reverse engineering was for Doxter because he said he he would he'd given up really really he'd given up and then challenged me to see if I could do it and I did <laughs> half of it <laughs> but we won't mention the other half. <laughs> now I've got some Python scripts, mate. The there's there's two lot. Well, there's two. Hang on, let me get in there. Let me get in there. Right. So there's the Patreon repo that you're going to get access to. Yeah. So um, repos. Du, 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 du. So here, infiltrator to kick conversion. That's what it. That's what it started out as, but it's not anymore. 
Um, so we've got um, convert a character set file to assembly. So that's converting a character set binary file to kick assembly. Then this is this is converting a character set binary file to uh, CBM Prog Studio format. This one does the um, conversion con uh, reformatting of the disassembly file to kick. This reformats the disassembly file to CBM Prog Studio. You're using kick. All right, so you want to use that one for the for the character set. You'll want to use that one to clean up the ASM file. And you want to use that one for the sprites, the sprite binary file, and that converts it into assembly. <laughs> you should you should think about going to CBM, mate, because we we've uh, version four is gonna have kick, uh, kick in assembly integration, and a few other things. Mate, it, it, it's never a waste of time because it teaches you how it teaches you how to do it. But now you've you've got an automated way of doing it. Now you know. Now you know how it's done manually. The Python basically does the manual work for you. <laughs> so um, yeah. Use the if you if if you if you've got Python installed, Python three, by the way, Python three, um, use those scripts. Microman uses them, and I know a couple of other people uses them. Doxter, did you use them? Did you use them? I'll let him answer. I might might be on a delay. Anyway, but these are available to everyone. Yeah. These are available to everyone. Right. No, you don't. Okay. You like doing things the hard way, mate. <laughs> right. Back to what we were trying to do. Right. So. You're already in Discord. So you should be, you should be a gold member. There you are, and you are. There you go, mate. And you are. You got gold writing all over you. Welcome to the patron family. Right. Now I've done the shameless promotion. <laughs> it's not very often I get to talk about that, but there we go. Um, right. So what? I, what? I, the control system. What I want to do is I want to have the control system that can. One control system that can do both the 2D version and the 3D version. You're not in the patron family. Yes, you are. You're golden, mate. In Discord, you're golden. Yes, you are. You've got a gold name, mate. Well, you have in mine. That's the patron family. Oh, you mean you can't see yourself in the patron family? Well, you're definitely not there. Ooh. Oh, I know why, mate. You, you're off. You, you're offline. You're offline. You're offline. So you're in the off, offline area. That's what. There we go, anyway. Yeah, thanks, Doxter. Anyway, so, back to back to what we want. One control system that controls both the 2D and the 3D version. So, what we're going to do is we're going to be having the um, assembly assembler directives. You know the directives, this bit here? We're going to have to put that into the the uh, gameplay so we're going to have the direct i think think let's have a look let's let's think on this so i'm going to need an did we say was oh we're going to use a as the forward weren't we yeah so a is going to have a is going to have two two meanings 
So it's in 2D mode means go up. In 3D mode means go forward. Z's gonna be not is not gonna be around in uh, 3D uh, 3D mode. So we can use the directives. So what what we can do? We can actually start doing this. So if if um, easy 2D. Ooh. Oh, what's going on with my keyboard? Right. Then do that. And we will do that. So we'll copy that. Now, we need to still evaluate key down, even though we're going to absolutely get rid of this right so that's that and then this full stop that is the two that's the uh, that's the 2d version and the 3d version oh oh hang on Yeah. So there. Now I need to move that to there. I need to done both of them there to there. Because we're gonna use right that one we're not using in three D mode. That one we're gonna use in two D mode. So the controls, so this is what we're going to do, and then in hard, if it's hard, right, so in here we would do the, up, the, the update. So we've got the 3D version here, look, so we've got the code for the 3D version, so, so we can, um, we can copy that. We can copy that. So let's put the three D in. So if then we gonna do ash else. If and it's hard two D, isn't it? Well, I think it's LF, isn't it? Yeah, LF. And also, this has got to be medium 2D as well, hasn't it? Because we're using the same control system. I think that's how you do it. Oh, is it two? Oh, hang on. Is it two? Yeah. So if it's that or that. So we'll just do this for the moment. Like that, like that, right, and we will add this in as well, so we're not doing it for down, because there's no such thing as down in hard mode, right, so just to make sure that that's still working in 2D, let's, let's see if it still allows us to move around. Right, yeah, so we haven't broken the controls for 2D. So, let's just make sure that the medium works. <laughs> yep. Yep, we're still moving. So we haven't bust, ooh, gone the wrong way. <laughs> gone the wrong way again. Oh, hang on. There is a way out. I've just spotted it. There it is. No. Oh. 
I'm not too I'm not too sure we need this on here. I'm not too sure we need that there. Uh, medium, make maze invisible. Hard. Where's medium? I don't think we need that. Right, let's try that again. Right, we see the maze being built. Right, that's better. That's how it should be. That you only see part of the maze and then hope for the best. Right, so that's done. Now, if we go into hard mode. We sh oh we still have the controls. Right, we still have the controls because we've put them in. We put the we put the controls in hard mode. Um, it's um, here. There. So what we need to do now is um, we're gonna we're gonna get rid of that routine in preference for the. The, two, the, the original routine, this one here. So we've got left and right. So we can do left and right. So here is comma. So if we look for comma, that's here. So we can grab this. Right. And put it in comma. Here. So that would go there. Then it would come into this, and that's what we need. And so this, I need to take that out and put it at the end. And same with, no, not with that. No, not with that, but this one we do. Like so, there we go. Right, so that's gonna move to the end because that's Check saying the, the directions change and we're doing it here on each routine and we don't need to so that's the comma and then the full stop is this one so if we grab that and put that on the full stop which is here on the hard hard bit there we go so that's that's done the rotation so I should be able to, in here, get rid of that. Where's the player? Where's the player, 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 player? There. Player controls. There we go. So we can, we can now say, if we run that out... We can get get rid of that. Now, that sh is going to work on all modes eventually, right? So, we've done that. So, we, we should now be able to rotate as before we using the, the one routine. So, there we go. So, we should be able to rotate. And we are... Nicey, nicey, nicey. Right. So. You alright? So. Now is the difficult bit. We have got to write the forward routine. So the forward routine is going to have to now take it's going to have to take consideration of which way we're pointing and then do the working out of which way we're pointing and so what we need to do is we need to take this yeah and i think we need to because that code's going to be that code's going to be used twice. That code's going to be used twice, so we should really make function out of it. 
Um, okay, Microman, we'll see you in a bit, yeah? So, um, so basically we need to make some functions out of that. So let me fire another pane up and we'll stick it on the end. We'll stick it on the end here. So, uh, ba -ba -ba. so let's say the first one is going up. So player goes up. And what we need is effectively this. It's all of that. No, it isn't. 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 It's that. Right. So we need a way. We need a way of... Um, Telling, telling the calling system that we cannot move into that position. So here, so branch if equal, and this one is, this is basically cannot move. So can not move. So we'll say the cat when the carry's clear it can't move. But if we can move, we'll we'll set the carry. Right, so let's get some comments in it. So no inputs. But we have got an output which is carry clear equals cannot move and carry set means we can move so here we're going to go JSR player goes up so play goes up and then we're gonna we're gonna test so if branch if carry clear to here if it's set then we do that and that's for the easy yeah that's for the easy so um so we'll do the rest we'll do the same for play goes down play goes down so we need this just that bit and paste it into there Then player goes, player goes right. So basically it's just that line that we're changing. And then player goes left. And it is that line we are changing. So, we basically do this. Yeah. So, in this one, paste that in. So, this is down. And we get rid of that and keep that. 
Same with this. This one's going right. Get rid of that. Keep that. Yep. And same with this. Just need that. And that. Right. We've done a few changes, so let's just make sure we ain't bust it. Because normally I break things, as you know. Right, here we go. So, we should be still be able to navigate. Right, so we got a problem with left. Down's okay. Oh, no. Oh. That, I bust it. What am I doing wrong? Have I forgotten to change copy or something? Hang on. Right, so A goes up, Z goes down. Yeah. Play goes right. Oh, play goes up. That doesn't help. That's left. And so let's just make sure testing left there. Right, down, and up. Okay, let's try that again. Right. So we can go left and right. Oh, there we go. We can go left and right. Okay, can we go up and down? So down, up, down, right. Everything's working. Right, so they're still working. So let's go into hard. And that should be still working on the rotation. Yeah. Right. So, what we need to do now is work out the forward motion. So we're concentrating on the A. So it's going to be all in here. So we need to test the direction. We need to test the direction and then perform that direction. So, um, we have a direction flag, I do believe, I do believe. Direction flag, where's the direction flag? That's the one there. So, um... Yeah. So, here we go. So, there's our direction flag. So, uh, I'm not using X, so I might as well use it. I don't think I'm using X. No, I'm not using X. So, load the direction. So, CPX hash direction down. Up. Right left K so we need to uh, we need to put some labels in here uh, we'll do that pointing up Pointing right, pointing left. Right, 
branch if not equal to pointing up. Let's grab that, put that there, put that there, put that there. So that's right, left. Um, where should that go? That should be able to go back here. There. That should be able to go back there. I think there's a... It shouldn't be too far of a leap from there. We'll see. We'll see. So if it's none of those, it comes out and says, it's not one of these, any of these directions. Right. So... So if we're going up and basically we just copy what's in here. Do that. Perform the up. Uh, perform the down. This, this, oh no, hang on. That's perform down. This is perform up. Yeah. Go right. Go left. Right. So if we can't go in that direction, it won't do it. So we are going to jump on these. Because we need to make it do the player move, which is down here. Now, the player move... Player move. Need to see how I've um, got this in the main one. So when it's in hard mode. So we do the direction. We load that the direction's changed. Branch if plus to bypass it. So it's not changed. Draw the slices. Right. We're not going to get, we're not going to draw the slices in here. We're not going to draw the slices. We're just going to get it to jump out. And, um, here we go. Put some spaces in here so I can so we can separate it out. Right, so we're gonna get it to go to jump play and move. Which is here. But it doesn't do anything hard move, so we set the player's directions moved. So once we've done that, we then in hard mode, we then check that the direction's changed. Right. Okay. <laughs> should we? Should we try? Should we try it? <laughs> should we try it? Okay. 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 Let's go. Let's see. Come on. My logic is sound. Right. That's the map. Right. So here we go. Straight forward, so we're pointing left. So I should, if I press A, we should go forward. Did we go forward? 
No, we're not going forward. Okay. Right, let's put some breakpoints in there. Let's see why. Da -da 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 -da. Let's see why. So, um, play control. It's what we want. So it's this one here. So we're going to put a break point here. Right. Let's see. Is it doing anything? Is it doing anything? Go. Draw the maze. Get rid of it. Right. A. There we go. Right. So we're loading the direction. What direction are we in? We should be two. And it is. CPX01. No. CPX03. No. CPX02. Yes. Right. Do forward. Load X, load Y, click Harry, go and see what it is. Okay, pull back the thing. Oh, push the status, load the character back. Right, so now we should hit 84. 84, so 4, 4, 4 is, hang on, 4 is, let's go into that mode, he's going, he's right, okay, and it with right, 4, means, so we should be, right, here we go, we can move, okay, Right, let's do it. Branch of carry clear. Ah! Ah! <laughs> ah! Plank! Plank. Plank, plank, plank. <laughs> We've tested that we can do it, and then we don't do it. <laughs> oh, what a plank. <laughs> right, let's get in there. Right, so here we go. So, um, going up. So going up is that. So we need to do that for going up. We need to do that for going down. Um, we need to do this for going right and going left it's deck <laughs> I can't believe I can't believe we didn't even tell it what to do <laughs> it just sits there what? what? <laughs> right Oh dear. Let's get rid of that. Right, we should. Yeah, well, you sh you should have all spotted it. You should have gone, Oi, John, you've you've detected the keys, but what are you gonna do? No one spotted it. <laughs> right. Here we go. I'm confident it's going to work. Bring it on. Come on. Right. Forward. A. Come on. Forward. Whoa. Where did that go? That's rotating. <laughs> that is rotating. Oh, is it? 
Why is that going down? That shouldn't be going down. I have got the right ones on the right ones, haven't I? Hard. Going down. Decrease Y. Oh, what? Yeah. But going... Hang on. Going down is increasing... Is increasing Y. Why is it decrease? Going up is decrease. Pointing right. That's increasing X. <laughs> decreasing. You guys. You guys. Come on. You're supposed to be helping me. There's AMK points up for grabs here. Who's top, by the way? Who's top? Oh, Andy. Right, here we go. Here we go. I'm glad we had that mini map because I would have been going, what is going on? But I think it's rotating as well. Right, that's looking forward. So now, A should go forward. That should come closer to us by one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. And another one. Come on. Get in there. Come on. One more. Nice. Now let's see if we can walk through a wall. No! Great stuff. Right. So if so if I'm looking east and I want to go that south, I need to go right. Oh yeah. Come on, go forward. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. E. That's it. Stream over. Got it working. First Oh, it blew up. But hang on, that might be the mini map. That's the may, it may be the mini map that's got the problem. That may be the mini map. <laughs> Let's shit it. Let's ship it. Yeah. <laughs> right. Hang on. Turn left. Yeah, it's the minimap that's the problem, isn't it? Minimap's got a problem. Right, we can look at that. Down. Forward. Up. Oh, this is so cool. Ho, 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 ho. Likey. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oops. And we're going down to a T-junction. Oh, this is working so well. Okay, where am I going now? Oh, that's going backwards. Oh, no. I want to go all the way, don't I? That's it. Then down. Then... That way. Oh, here we go. Come on, John. You can do it. So, if I'm looking that way, I want to go that way. Yep. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Oh, I like this. Oh, this is hard. This is <laughs> Come on. It, it. It's doing it. I have no idea if I'm anywhere near the end. <laughs> oh, that looks like a dead end. Yeah, you told me I went the wrong way. That is definitely a dead end, isn't it? <laughs> right. So we got a problem with the minimap. So we'll we'll keep that at the back. Keep that at the back of the Z. So what we need to do now is we need to. I'm at the moment. I've got the direction up. Direction up here. Yeah. I think we need to say um, 
pointing we uh, pointing west, pointing south, pointing east, pointing west. So you, so it gives the user the feedback that they know which direction they're pointing, yeah? And also, do we want it to remember where we've been? Because there's no yellow trail, yeah? Do we want it to remember where the person's been? Have a compass. Yes for easy, no for hard. Oh, so hard. Hard mode as an easy and an hard mode. <laughs> Excellent. Okay, uh, a, a compass. How, how would we do a compass? We've only got... Oh, stick a sprite. Yeah, I've not thought about using sprites. Not thought about using sprites. Um, yeah, we could do that. Yeah, we, we, we could do that. Have a sprite on the screen. Yeah. Do you think that would work? So... We'd have the word north, south, east and west and then a sprite just pointing to the right one. Yeah. Let's make us... Well, we haven't got... We have, we've got... I mean... If my memory serves me right, we've only got two arrows on the on the Commodore keyboard. We haven't got the four. So a sprite, a sprite will do it. We'll do we'll we'll do it with a sprite. Oh, you mean you mean? Oh, I'm not changing the character set. I'm trying to use Petsky characters all the time. I think. Nah, not not that greater than less than. We'll use a sprite. It won't take two seconds to do that. So, um, yeah. So let's get the text on the screen. To, um, to say north, south, east and west. So N, S, W and E. Yeah, where's Stacy when you need him? Yeah. <laughs> Look, I'll ma I'll do my best, and I'm sure somebody will come up with a better one. Right, let's get some text on here. So let's run this in. Um, see, let's run this in debugger so we can see the cells, and then we can work out where we're going to put it. Ladies and gentlemen, six thousand five hundred and two kebab has entered the chat. The man himself has entered the chat for the first time in weeks, even though somebody else has been using this soundtrack. <laughs> hey, Warlock. Mate, someone's been saying that they've been used got in for the last couple of streams, I'm telling you. Someone's been impersonating you. Right. Let's get this. Morning, Warlock. Got your cup of coffee? How's the good Dan under today? Oh, what a rubbish Australian accent. <laughs> uh, right. So, uh, we're trying to find a place to put our compass. So, we're talking down here. Yeah? Yeah, crikey. What? Oh, yeah. What's that, Skippy? Man, down a well? Really? Where? Congo Creek? Right. Go show me. <laughs> I remember that program. Oh, show me age. Right. So, we need... We need a compass here. We need a compass here. So, a sprite is 3B... It's 21 down, isn't it? So that's, so it's a 3b3 really, isn't it? A sprite, 3b3. 
So that's a 3v3. So if we say... Nope. It's 21 pixel... 24 across, isn't it? Oh, 3v2.5. Okay. But 3v3 in, in... In whole character numbers. Right. So if we say that's north... Is... Oh, that's, col that's column 20... That's hex 22. Right. So north is going to be... 22 across and D down so if that's where so then 1 2 3 there so south is going to be 22 across but um, 11 down it, 11 down okay so move back move back one to there and then up to there so D D E F yeah F's in the middle right so west east so we are down dollar F and we are 20 going that way and go one two three there so that's gonna be 24 He's sending messages to my machine. I'm trying. To, I'm, I'm trying to increase the character set on it, but don't send any dodgy characters because I'm still working on it. There's there's only like 40 characters in it. I think 40, 26, 36. Yeah, 40. I think there's 42 characters in it in the character set. I'm trying to. Have, I'm trying to make some more characters for it. Right. So we've got. We've got that, so our our place is going to be there. The centre of our sprite is going to be there. So that's going to be one one five seven C. At a rough, rough estimate, rough, rough estimate. So, um, how we're gonna how are we gonna do the sprite? How are we gonna do the sprite? Um, <laughs> right. So we are not in multicolor mode. Don't want to be in multicolor mode. Um, Settings. I want to see the characters. No. Right. So uh, I wanted it. Oh, why is it not showing me in characters? All right, then. okay, we'll have to work it out. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So that's the halfway point. So that's the halfway point of our sprite. So we're talking there, and our middle is here. That's our middle. So, um, a Star Trek communicator symbol. Oh my, oh my, oh my. Let's have a look.
have we got that one? Let's see if we can do that one. So we'll move that over there. We'll move that. Oh, stop going in full screen mode. So we're going to try. Where is it? Oh, I've lost it. Oh, there's that simple one. Where's the one with the markings on it? Right, let's find it again. There, that's the fella. Just gonna try and do that. Try, try and do that. Cool, that's gonna be hard. Okay, so that's the middle. So we're. So it's below the middle, so it's about there. That's where the arch is, isn't it? <laughs> Draw. Oh, it's gonna be painful. This is. That doesn't look like a communicator to save my life. Well, I'm expecting some feedback, so. How's that look? Fat! <laughs> Only you, mate. Only you. Right, so... No, no, no. Right, that's just... No. No, 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 no. Pants, looks pants. I've, the, the shape's roughly there, isn't it? It's good enough ship it. Okay, okay, mate. Right. You're right, though. It does it doesn't. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> he, told, he told me. Right, okay. So let's do let's do another one. This time um I'm gonna copy. Oh Oh I can't delete either. Oh that's pants. Can add but we can't delete. Right. Copy that. Paste it into that. Right, so we are going to flip it. Flip it, flip it, flip it. Yep. Yeah. Paste. Sprite sh rotate. Do can we rotate? Oh, that's not good. Look. <laughs> oh, dear. Thanks, mate. Just take the mick out my, um, there's no rotate. I thought there was a rotate in there. Right, okay. Let's fire good old faithful up. So I'll bring that over there. Oh. Okay, what happened? Did that create it? I'm using an older version. Hang on. Let me go to the new proper one. Oh no. Where's the character set gone? Ah. Half of these files don't load up now. Which one? Which one am I willing to bust? No, I'm not going to do that. Uh, the character set branch has gone missing, hasn't it? Okay, um... We'll make it then. Where's the sp where's the sprite? I have really trashed this, haven't I?
Give me the sprite editor. There we go. And it's not there. Good old faithful, go back to three. Right, where's that sprite gone? There it is. So let's re replicate it in here. File, new, new sprite. Right, here we go. So we are one down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Right, black. One, two, so that's eight, nine, ten, eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Is that halfway? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. There, that's where it is. Right, then down two, down two, down two. One, two, three, four twos. One, two, three, four, three, three, two. Quick U turn. One, 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 two. Two, 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 one, two down, one, three up, three up, two up, two up, one, two, three, and the rev, we've got twos. Hurry! We are in. Right. I'm just wondering if we need to make that fat, need to make the lines fatter. Well, that does it, doesn't it? That looks better. Be a bit more defined at the top. There we go, that looks all right, doesn't it? It's too square, that is. Right. Okay, so let's create a new sprite. So we'll copy this. Paste. Oh, we need a new sprite, don't we? File. New. 
paste. So we're going to flip it. There we go. Right. New. Paste. Then we're going to... Do we do rotate here as well? Don't don't say we don't do rotate. Really? Oh yes we do. Here we go. Rotate 45 degrees. Undo. Right, paste. Rotate 90. There we go. Right. Next one, paste, rotate 270, get in there, right, so that's, that is, we need to shift that up, get it in the centre, that's in the centre, shift that up so it's in the centre, that's in the centre, is that in the center? Yep, that's in the center. And that's in the center. Right! Right, save, 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 save. Okay, so, file, export. Export to binary. Okay, all sprites. And we are going to put it, it, put it in. There. So, um, right. So we've got the Navi pointer. So, um, I want to let's get rid of that. <laughs> Cheers, mate. Um, I want to... Um, now, we're going to use the infiltrator. We're going to use the infiltrator code to uh, convert it into kick. So, open folder. Infiltrator. There we go. So I'm going to copy that code that we've just, I've just, that bin file, we just copied. I'm going to, going to copy it in there. Where are you? Yeah, there it is. And we'll paste it into there. Right, so. It should be in here. There it is. Navi pointer. Right. So we need to. We're going to use the sprite to ASM. So this 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 file here. So here we go. So we need to run this command. And our input file is navi pointer dot bin on our output file is nav navi pointer dot asm where's navi pointer there it is so hope uh, you know we'll do it txt to start with right here we go so fingers crossed boom converted into Sprite data. Get in there, John. Get in there. Right. Let's copy that back. Don't need that anymore. Right. So... There are navi pointer dot text, so we'll rename that to be ASM. There you go. Our sprites have now been converted into kick 
assembly code. So now we can try and embed this. So we need to figure out where we're going to put them. Where are we going to put them? Where are we going to put them? Um, first, let's find out how much memory we're taking up with our program. So the way to do that is just to run your code and it comes up in this at the bottom. So I've run it and there it is. Right, so let's close all that lot. Up. So, well, we, we, we ain't got a lot of memory to play with. We're, we're taking up quite a lot of space. <laughs> yeah, we're taking up a lot of space there. Yeah, um, I'm just wondering. I'm just wondering. Um, if let's we'll put the put it at three thousand. Yeah, we'll put the sprite data at three thousand. So three thousand. Oh well, yeah, bang on, right. Your suggestion is bang on three thousand. So that's what we'll do. So we're in the master file. So we'll go star equals dollar three thousand sprite data and then hash import uh, navi pointer.ism. So, um, Now we've got that done, we need to then have a constant. So we need to have constants. So we'll put them in here. All right. Dot, 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 dot. We'll do constants. So um, pointer up. So 3,000, that's, uh, so 12, 1288, that is sprite pointer 192, I think. I'm just trying to remember what order we did them. Up, down, right, left. Up, down, right, left. So that's three, four, five. Okay. So we've got the sprites, got the sprite in place. So we now need to, when we set up the hard mode, which is here, we need to now um, put in our, put in our left, ooh, hang on. Right, I'm gonna rearrange. I'm gonna rearrange this because our controls is zero is left. So this is zero, yeah. So we'll put that at sprite zero. And then sprite one is down. Sprite one is down, which is it? Which it is. Sprite two is right. Is right and sprite three is up. Right. Right, let's change those constants again. 
So up is so left is one nine two. So that must be one nine four. No. Five. One nine five. Two, three, four, five, yeah. That'll make it easier for us. That'll make it that'll make it easier. Bit of forward thinking there. Right. So we need to um we need to uh la, la, la. let's do a bit of copying. Maze window, maze window. Here we go. Clear maze. So, right, X and Y. X and Y is the values that we need to put in. So Y is, t y is uh, going down. Right, so. So LDX hash. Um, twenty. LDY hash D. Right, so that, um, then we go to work out the screen position. So that works out the screen position. So now we've got our zero page locations. So LDY hash two and LDA Hash, isn't it? That it's that's for it's single quotes for uh, screen um, codes, isn't it? Right. So LDY hash. So we're on the right, so we need to go down two rows, so that's, that's 80. And that's going to be west. Then it's going to be... Uh, Four eighty four. It's going to be east and south is going to be one six one sixty two south. Right, that's sh right. Let's see. I mean, we're in hard mode yet. That should put our four coordinates on. No, it didn't. No, it didn't. What have I done wrong? Maybe. What's the screen codes? What's the, what's the symbol for screen? Is it double quotes for screen codes? I tell you what, let's go on the let's go on Tinterweb. Let's get the screen codes. Right, N. N is oh right, N. Q. 
W is 17. E is 0, 5. And S is 13. Right, let's see if that puts it up. Oh, wrong key. Ugh. I think it did it. I just think we're in the wrong place. Oh, Wally. All right, Doctor. We'll see you next time, yeah? Get some rest. Me, I'm the Wally. Oh, it's doing it here. Did you see it come up there? Right, let's put a break point there. Right, where are you being placed? Let's have a look. Yeah, it's been put there. Right, okay. I'm in the wrong place. So... So we need to add... Uh, da, 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 da. 32 34 um, 114 118 96 oh hit the wrong key again Right. <laughs> okay. Well, that's... We are too far over. We are too far over. So, let's knock... Two off that. Two off that. And two off that. There we go. Right. So we, we've done that. Then we need to activate a sprite. We need to activate sprite zero. So LDA hash. Store it in. Um, That one. So that's turning that on. And LDA hash uh, one. In fact, we'll do that. Store it in there. LDA hash 
Uh, do do one one uh, fifteen. LDA hash seven C. Store it in there. Right, LDA hash. Uh, the in fact, in fact, in fact, um, we'll hardwire it for the moment. One nine. Four. Store it in. Oh, I bet I don't have the pointers on here. Bet we don't have the pointers in here. No. So it's uh, dollar oh seven F zero, isn't it? Right, so the point is wrong, and we're not in the right place. We're almost there. We're almost there. So, um, let's make that 30. And we'll... But, oh! Oh, is it that one? Right, so, okay, we went too far. Cheers, mate. Hello, <laughs> Labrador. <laughs> he may think he's a Labrador, but he's no, he's no Labrador. Nico. Say hello, buddy. Come here. Come here. One, two, three. There we go. What are you growling at? Hey? Say hello. Say hello. All right, mate. I'll put you down. Yeah, growl. Why do you want to growl? He suffers from seizures. He's on opiates or barbiturates, I think. So he's high as a kite most of the time. Right, let's pull. Let's pull it back. Let's put this back to fifteen. Nah, he doesn't like being picked up. The only time he wants to get picked up is when he jumps on you. Right, okay, so... Right, okay, so... 30 was too far, 15's not far enough, so we'll go 22. Ooh, 20. And we want to go down at least 8. So 9C, that's going to be A3. Right, hopefully we are in the middle. Ooh. I'll just pull it back one more. Right, so 
let's before I run it again I want to make sure that it spit it goes round so we need to we need to apply we need to apply the direction change to it so what we're going to do is once the win what's the once the windows drawn we're going to load the we're going to load the direction there we go we're going to load the direction We'll CLC add uh, hash 192, store it in $07F8. So that then should then ref, ref, we'll run that out so we don't have it. That should then update our sprite. So let's have a look. So we start off pointing east, yeah? So pointing east. So we'll go forward one. Right, and then we'll turn. So turn, I think this is south. Oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> right, forward one. Go east. Oh yeah. Get in there. Forward, south, west. Ooh, it's just touching. Right, we'll pull it back. We'll pull it back one. So put it back to 20. Right, so facing east. Oh, long way. So we got plenty of way. So we'll go forward one. We will look south. Nice. Look west. That is strange. It's it's saying there's a big tunnel behind us, but there isn't. Hmm. And then we've got north. So east again. So we'll move forward. Then go south. East again. North. Nice. East. South. Nice. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Nice. Oh, I've gone down a dead end again. Right. Um, need to go west. Then north. West again. South. Right, we'll go down this road. South. That's north. Here we go. This is the way we want to go. South. East, yeah, that's right. South, east, north, east. God, this is hard. Oh, <laughs> this is hard. <laughs> I know, playing without the map. <laughs> it's hard. <laughs> and we're going to be, and we're planning on putting bad guys in there to make it even worse. Oh, this is hard. All right, north. Let's do north, 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 north. West, north, east, north, west, north, east, south, east, north, north. Oh, no, I'm not going south. I'm going north. Still got the bug on the minimap. So we need to, we need to look at the bug on the minimap. <laughs> yeah. So we still got this. But yeah. <laughs> We're moving around the map. We are moving around the map. Still think well I did ask that question whether we should have the foot, the the yellow. Um I mean we can do it. The mini map will do it. We just have to, because at the moment, when we move, we're not actually setting any of the status flags. So, um, 
So in player, we're not actually setting any um, of the status flags. So if we look in set player color, I think it's in there. Yeah, it's it's in here where we set the mask. So what we can do is we can do the same thing. So we grab that and we put it in where we um, where we actually doing all the 3D stuff. So it's here, right? Here we go. So it's here because <laughs> we draw the mini map. So here we can spec say right. That's the path. Right, so let's see. Let's see if that does it now. Right, so forward, uh, south. Forward, there we go. Right, north, east, south. Whoop, 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 losing track when we're west. S no, no, not north. South. East. South. That, right, there you go. So that's the footprint. So we've, we've, we've got, so we've got the footprints on, on the minimap now. I, th I think, um, yeah. So let's why let's figure out why the minimap's having a bit of an issue. Um, oh, I know why. I know why. I know why. Let's just do this. Right. Before we Before we draw the new minimap, let we click we should clear it. Right, let's see. Right, so only ways forward. Right, so we'll go we'll intentionally go south. Uh, west, south, east. Right, so we'll go back, right? North, because this is where the bug came in, yeah? East, north. Right, the minimap's now, it's now working, because we're clearing it out before we redraw it again. So, well, that's so sorted that out. Oh, this is cool. Hey, hey, hey. Hard? <laughs> Got you not enough fingers. Um, east, yeah, we're going east, then north, then west, then north. Oh, dead end. Ah! Ah! Dead end. Right. So, um, so we've got the the direction indicator working now. Thanks for Monsignor Stewart, which I am going to reward him for the excellent idea. There you go, mate. Because that was a good, good idea. So, um, so we need... We need the. T I think we need to relocate. Re well, for the hard mode, we need to relocate the timer to here. For the easy modes, it still needs to be up there. Um, but I think the hard mode timer should be here. Um, I'm wondering whether to have a. No, no, that would be. No, that would be stupid. <laughs> I was just about to say. Maybe the timer should be a running out timer for hard mode, but that's going to that's gonna be stupid. Because <laughs> no one will ever get to the end. 
<laughs> uh, that's a stupid idea. It may it's a cool one, but it makes it really, 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 really... It's hard. It's going to be ultra hard. Right. So, let's see if we can relocate the timer in hard mode. Um, so, this is where the timer is. So, we need to go into timers and update timers. So this is the display timer. So the display timer All oh, right, okay. So we have we're we're physically storing in the timer locations. Okay. So game constants is it in there? Timer location? Nope. It's not in there. So was it in uh, oh, I wonder if it's in timers. Actually, in timers. Game timer. No. Okay. So, where are you? Game constants. Here. Aha! There's the timer location. So, what we might need... To, what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to do the same thing here. So, if hard... <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. My beta bot broke again. Let's have a look. No, he's working fine. I don't know how you've managed to do it. You're are you you're not an admin. Hang on, who's my admins? Right, I need to look at that. I need to look at that. I'll have a look at that because the ad it shouldn't allow you to do it. You're just special, yes mate, you are. But sorry, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to take those points off you. You know, mate. I'll, I'll give you some points for finding a bug, mate. I'll tell you that now. I'll give you some points for finding the bug. No, no, no. I'll give you some points to, for finding the bug. But yeah, you've you've found a bug. My test for the administrators is not working. By looks on it. <laughs> All right. Oh dear. Good. Hang on. Let me make a note of that. Uh, Warlock found a bug in my bot. I'll have a look at that because I'm in, I'm messing around with the beta bot. I'm messing around with the beta bot at the moment because I'm trying to get it when you put a message on there, there. I'm going to try and make it do on the scroll as well, so it's on the scroll. So I was looking at that. So uh, yeah, you've you found a bug. Never mind. It's what we do. Right. So if it's hard, if it's not. Elif. And then end. Oh. 
Why is that not doing it? Oh, else. Else. That's what I want. Hard 2D. Right, so if it's anything else, it's that. But if it's hard, we, got, we want to be in a different place. So we need to um, where we need to work out where we want it. Your centipede cloud. Oh no, mate! You you copied my Pepsi, mate. Pepsi peed. Oh, you're doing TRSE. All right. I, 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 I got too many things going on to mess around with other um, programming standards, mate. I'd love to have done the Shallon thing, but it was just, it was soaking up too much time and all the other stuff anyway. But I, 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 if you want to if you want to test it, mate, I'll test it. I'm really rubbish at it, but I'll test it. All right, okay. Right, so, um, let me close that down. Don't need that anymore. Oh, I've got a dialog box somewhere. There it is. Right, so, let's run this in, D in debug mode and figure out where we can put the timer. Hang on a second, guys.
Sorry, guys. That was Mrs. OSK. Right. Ah, <laughs> muted. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right. Yes, monsters going to be in there. Going to be chasing you. And we're going to have the monsters on easy and medium modes as well. But what we're going to do is there's going to be two, two sort of uh, aspects to the game. The maze solving. Yeah. And... The maze running, maze running for a better term. So maze solving is you just, you're racing against the clock trying to solve the maze. Maze running is you're racing against the clock trying to solve the maze while avoiding the bad guys that are after you. <laughs> so yeah. Right, let's see if we can figure out where this location is. I'm sure there's a screen. Uh, C64 screen layout. Oh no! Ah, here we go. So we said five up. One, two, three, four, or five. So that's one eight, two four, and we said eight in. So that's plus thirty two. So that's going to be one eight five six. Right, calc. <laughs> you, you, you're seriously overestimating my abilities, mate. <laughs> right, here we go. Let's so uh, one eight five six seven forty. Right. 740, so in hard mode would be 0740. Well, we can have a go. I mean, this that's the whole point of this. Is, is We're all learning how to do stuff. Right. Hopefully, now we're in hard mode, that should have relocated the timer. Get in there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Right, so the timer's now out of the way. So, um, so I think, right, now we've got, now we've got it working and it, we've got it working quick and dirty, right? We've got the quick and dirty code in there for the slicers. We've got, you know, we've repeated the same function five times with different numbers. So, in the next stream, yeah, yeah, I, I, it didn't act on uh, orig, on on orig, orig, origin, orig, on orig. There you go. It was his first time, and so it, it crashed me bot. So I've had to do it by hand. 
So there's two books. There's the latest sub and and, and you you pretending you're an administrator when you're not. <laughs> but I'll get it sorted. I, I'm, I've I've I'm, I've been messing around with it. See if I can do the messaging. Get the messaging on the on the scroller bar as well. Right. So I think I've achieved what I wanted to do today. We can navigate around a maze and it's fast for one page I say facing up it is fast right we're going south yeah oh no that's north south Okay, so we want to go east and north. <laughs> hey, what? Thanks for the bits, mate. Thanks for the bits. So, I've 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 done what I wanted to do in this stream, which was to be able to navigate through the maze in our 3d in our 3d world but the code is quick and dirty yeah so we need to um we need to look and then in the next stream i think we need to, we'll we need to look at the code and try and compress those seven routine uh, five routines into one and and it and, and yeah and so we only have the one routine to run instead of ha running five five slices. But then again, then again, the program is really, really small. It's not like we're absolutely running out of space. And it is lightningly quick. I am really chuffed about the speed of this thing. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Oh, and it's a dead end. Need to go that way, don't we? A dead end. Uh, oh, no, no, no. No, back up one. There we go. So we're going back this way. Oh, no. Got to go down that snake. Oh, snake, snake. Snake, snake, snake. Oh, wrong way. North, it, west, north, east, north, west. So we're going back up there. So we need to, one more. Now we need to go that way. Oh, snaky, snaky. Give some straights. There we go. Oh, no, it's dead end. Oh, this is, this is hard. <laughs> this this is hot. I mean, 270 seconds. Oh, man. Can you imagine doing this and still having bad guys chasing you that knows where where you are and where you are in the map? Oops. Hey, Grey Defender. It'll be interesting to see if your, map, your maze solving code works on this. If he's still on. Oh, we need to go south, don't we? West. South. East. Ooh, dead end. North. East. Oh, dead end. Oh, come on, John. Get a grip. South. West. North. West. North, east, north. Oh, I have no idea if I'm going the right way. So we need to go down there at least anyway. It this is lightning quick. I I I'm liking this. I I am really pleased with the speed we're getting out of this. 
Oh, can't go all the way down to the bottom. That's a dead end. Not. Hey, hey, hey. Right. Oh, oh, it's a dead end. Uh, we need to go that way, don't we? And then down. Oh, gone too far. Up there. 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 Down. Oh, man. This is taxing on the brain. Right, okay, so we need to go north, don't we? Ooh! South. West. One, down one. West. Then north. West. Then south. West. We're just going back, aren't we? We are. We're back on the edge again. I'm not going to find the end. Am I? Down one. East, John. East. South. East. Oh, am I going to regret going to the end? Oh, no. We could be on a winner. I just want to make it once. South. East. South. East. East. North. East. Oh, we're getting close. Got to be getting close. I have no idea where we are. <laughs> no idea where we are. Oh no. We're going to get there and it's going to be a dead end. South. East. South. West. North. Oh. West. South. East. South. Oh, I thought I was near the end there. <laughs> I thought I was near the end. And I'm not. Oh, the brain is getting fried. Oh, come on. Come on, got to do it. Come on, we're, we're so far. Oh, back, 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 back. North, east, south, east. South, West, South, East, South, come on, no, 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 not North, come on, this is the edge. This is the edge. Oh, I thought it was a dead end then. I thought it was a dead end. Come on. Get in there. We <laughs> <laughs> 594 se 595 seconds. How, what, how was that? What, seven minutes? <laughs> Get in there. Right, so we need to, we'll, we'll need to, we'll need to do some sort of, you know, well done. <laughs> you escaped the maze thing. But we did it. We got out. 
<laughs> I did it in a heart. <laughs> right. So, I've managed to do what I wanted today, which was to be able to move around the 3D space. We've combined the controls for both 2D and 3D into one routine. And um, yeah, but I've just thought of something. We're going when it comes to merging all the um, the modes together. We're going to have to have some sort of test. Because at the moment we're using assembler directives to include and exclude code. So that'll be something that I'll need to think about when we start merging the whole thing together. Right. Okay, guys. Well, thank you very much for joining me. I'm really pleased. <laughs> I'm going to be uploading the code to... The, the patron get up when I've uh, sorted myself out and got everything sorted. Uh, have a go, have a play, see what you think. Um, have a look at the display and see if you can see wh how I'm going to try and merge all the code together. And we'll have a look at the controls as well to see if we can merge the code together as, as well on that. And um, well, thank you very much for joining me. All right, and. Thanks for the patron on uh, on orange orange on orange. Oh, it's difficult to say that. Thank you for becoming a pa joining our patron family. All right, guys. Right, I will see you on Wednesday, hopefully, because I'm having the booster jab. So we'll see how I feel. All right. Take care, guys, and I'll see you very shortly. Bye. I'd like to thank all the Patreons that are contributing to my channel. Without you guys, I wouldn't be able to do what I'm doing right now. Thank you very much.